we also want to talk about the visit by the U.S. President Barack Obama. He is now saying he will keep his promise to visit Kenya in July, despite what the country is going through right now. Obama's message reached home as back in Kogelo village in Siaya County, Mama Sarah Obama announced her expectations of the visit. Catherine Omwantho reports. No one is waiting for his visit more than his grandmother, Mama Sarah Obama. The last time the U.S. president stepped in this home in Kogelo was when he was the Illinois senator in 2006. <laughs> I asked him to come the last time I paid him a visit in America and he said he would once everything settled down. Sarah Obama says that she cannot wait to cook for her grandson again. However, now that he is the president of the most powerful country in the world, she may have to be cautious with her expectations. He said that he's coming for work and he wants to see people here. Looking at the pictures, Mama Sarah tells of how Obama's children resemble their great aunt, the late Barack Obama Sr.'s sister. Barack Obama's father and mother were estranged. However, the U.S. president has kept seemingly close ties with his father's family, even after his death. Hey, okay. Over the years, Sarah Obama has earned various accolades, which she displays proudly. Despite the attack on Garissa University College on the 2nd of April that saw at least 147 students killed, the President of the United States of America has promised to stand by the Kenyan government, assuring Uhuru Kenyatta that he will make good his promise to visit the country in July. In a phone call to President Uhuru Kenyatta yesterday, Obama said that the U.S. will look into ways to strengthen counter-terrorism cooperation between the two countries. He finished off by saying that Kenya will not be defined by violence and terror. Catherine Omwando, KTN.